Sedimentary rocks are one of the three types of rocks that make up the rock cycle here on Earth. The other two are igneous and metamorphic, but sedimentary rocks are the only kind of rock you can find fossils. I'm Thor Giese. Since the dawn of time, humans have sought to understand their natural world and what a world it is. We're going to explore it through science, history, language, food, and great stories. Welcome to Thor's Outdoor Science Academy. So the word sediment comes from the Latin sedimentum. Sedimentum means settling. And that is exactly how sedimentary rocks form. Different layers of particles like mud, sand, or clay settle downwards as more and more layers of sediment pile on top of each other, like a giant stack of pancakes. The oldest layers are always on bottom because they were laid down first and the layers get younger as you go up. So yeah, oldest on bottom, youngest on top. Over thousands or millions of years of being buried, what used to be loose sediment is compressed into hard rock where all those tiny pieces of sand or silt or whatever have been smushed together and fused. If dead plants or animals get buried in the sediment under the perfect conditions, they will fossilize. But fossils are actually really rare in sedimentary rocks and on Earth for that matter. This is a tooth from a kind of mosasaur I found in sedimentary rock in Southern Colorado while on a survey. Mosasaurs were not dinosaurs, but marine reptiles. Remember, a uh, mosasaur was the kind that killed the Indominus Rex at the end of Jurassic World, but mosasaurs were way smaller than that in real life, but that was still a pretty sweet scene. Making a Cubano sandwich really shows how sedimentary rocks form. You have loose, distinct layers of different ingredients, or sediment. Under heat and pressure, the layers are compressed together to make one solid piece of delicious sandwich. Just like layers of loose sand formed into sandstone. Watch and learn. I don't find any fossils in this. See you next time on Thor's Outdoor Science Academy.